Continuation of the uh, previous video, I guess this will be video two about the removable or portable panel. I'm not sure what you're going to call it. Removable panel. It's not really a portable panel. Anyway, uh, I showed you how uh, along the, at the back and at the front, whichever side you want to name the back or the front. I also put two in the middle and uh, two in the middle down here so I can secure it to the van. So it will be replaceable, but I just want it to be in condition where if I need to drive with it, I have to leave. It's good enough for me to get somewhere to take it off. It's, it's gonna just pull off, but then I, I'm gonna get a, a separate cable from my, from my previous solar setup, run it into the back of my van, the hole I've already cut for some of my cameras. And then once I get that in there, then I will also be able to charge this, uh, this EcoFlow. Uh, this is unnecessary, but sometimes I do things that don't make sense. And I, now, I'm not saying this is wise to do. Putting uh, magnets on an electrical system. So it's, I could either be destroying the function of this panel altogether with these, with these uh, uh, magnets, which I think is doubtful, very, very doubtful. Uh, but I also could be diminishing the function. So this is not something I would advise anybody doing unless they do their research themselves. I did no research. So this is $160. If it damages it, damages it permanently doing this, this is a $160 bet I will lose, but it won't be the dumbest uh, uh, expenditure I've made this year. So I decided to give it a shot. So uh, these uh, over here, this is this uh, two-sided tape. I'm using just one side of it. I'm putting it over the each one of the nails to sort of prevent them from going into my hands if I grab the panel wrong. I'll put a couple of more here where you see these sticking up and here. I got a nipper somewhere where I can nip these off and I will be doing that, but I'm not gonna look for it now. I'm just going to, since this is a proof of concept test, I'm just going to leave it like this. Well, I'll add the couple of more of these little, couple of more of this to, so I don't grab them and hurt my hand when I grab the uh, the panel. But uh, uh, I'm not going to, uh, I'm going to nip these off later, assuming it does work. All right, let me go back out and let me uh, try to mount this. Then I'll start the video over again. All right, this is the current test of the, uh, the magnetic panel. I've got it up, yes, you know, this is a, this is a mounted panel. I've got it up against this mounted panel, but the only issue is wind shear. Uh, not much of an issue, but the wind shear to the front is the only thing that can probably pull this panel off. Now, these are very strong magnets. I just don't grab them and take them off that easily. Uh, I have to make sure that all of them have a metal contact. Now you see how close it is to this tire. So this is not something you want to run down the road with for an extended period of time. The tire might rub against it or, you know, anything is going to splash up on it. So it's not like I'm going to be riding this down the road, but it's just something I can put out real fast if I need to auxiliary charge or charge off a spare directly to my, my uh, EcoFlow. All right, I'm doing a little outlaw testing here and I'm checking my new if not permanent, what the heck did I do? If not permanent, uh, semi-permanent uh, panel for emergencies with my uh, my EcoFlow Delta EF Delta, and uh, I'm getting a about uh, 58, 59, 58 watts off of this panel, and I'm currently pointing up at a cloudy sky. So that shows that this is a proof of concept, basically. I need to put a, another magnet or two on here to, to secure that, so that if I need to move before I pull it off, I will be able to do it. So it's not something I'm gonna keep on my van all the time, but when I do wanna charge up the EF Delta, I can just put that out and charge it when I'm sort of lounging around. So we'll see. Anyway, uh, not too sure else what else I've got to do here. Hey, how you doing? Fine. Uh, well, that's about it. And, uh, so I, I did I did get it to work. 
that's going to be of use to me in the future. So I will, uh, I will, uh, now I can stop the outlaw testing I've been doing here and uh, go inside and act like a good, uh, good hotel residence for another day or so. Anyway, I will uh, talk to you later and you have a wonderful day. By the way, if you want to see it, that's it. And you, I don't know if you can actually see it, 62, 62 watts coming in just off that one single panel. So can't beat that. All right, talk to you later.